Hello and welcome to Channel Unlocks Hub. A very happy Christmas to one and all. Today in this video, I will be showing you how to remove iCloud lock or activation lock on an iPad. So here's an iPad mini which is currently iCloud locked. So I'll be removing the iCloud lock from this iPad mini permanently. If you need the custom IPSW firmware, please mail us on our mail ID given in the description box below the video. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below the video. Please watch the video completely, do not skip any step. And once again, a very happy Christmas to all of you. Let's begin the process. First, you have to put the device into DFU mode. To do that, first turn off the device. Hold the home and the power button simultaneously. As soon as the Apple logo disappears, let go of the power button, keep pressing the home button. Now you can see that it says device connected in DFU mode. Click on go to flash. There is an option called pro flash here. Let me move the iPad a bit. Click on this option pro flash and click on this query compatible SHSH. So it downloads all the SHSH. So now Click on import firmware and select the unlock sub custom IPSW for iPad mini and click on open. Now click on flash here. So this whole process takes somewhere around 20 to 25 minutes so make sure you have enough time to do it. can see all the details here please make sure you watch the complete video without skipping any step if you need the custom firmware please mail us on our mail id given in the description box below the video if you have any doubts let us know in the comment section below please do watch our other videos as well we have done multiple videos on a free bypass method as well free iCloud bypass basically using the check range jailbreaking tool and the uh, and some hacking codes basically so sometimes the tool shows this error error uh, at the line 13 33 1 no problem just minimize this open iTunes It says iTunes has detected an iPad in recovery mode. Click on OK and hold Shift and click on Restore iPad and select the Unlock Sub iPad Mini Custom IPSW. It says iTunes will erase and restore your iPad to iOS 13. Point, iOS 9.3.5 sorry and will verify the restore with Apple. Click on Restore. Please use the comment section below the video to ask all your doubts and questions.
don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. If you have any specific video recommendations like a specific device video, maybe please let us know in the comment section below. Now you can see that the installation is starting on this iPad. Please do not unplug your device at any point of time. Make sure you use the original USB cable of the device. This method will definitely fail if you, if you use any third party USB cables because they do not support the restoration process basically. It says your iPad has been restored to factory settings and is restarting, please leave your iPad connected. Do not unplug your device, wait for the device to turn on completely.
you can now see that the device is installing something this is the stage where the iCloud data is loaded back to the device do not unplug your device wait for the device to turn on completely and turn up on iTunes The iTunes has quit automatically, do not worry, just wait for the device to turn on completely. The iTunes actually went to the background basically. Yes, and the iPad has now completely turned on. You can see that here. This is the same iPad mini with which I started this video. And let me just uh, set it up quickly. Please make sure set it up as a new iPad only. Do not restore from any of the previous backup at least for the first startup. Chase welcome to iPad let me click on get started and now you are inside this iPad completely and let me go to settings to verify and you can see that there is no iCloud data here. The iCloud data is not there and you can use it like a new iPad without any issues. So you can use all the features, everything works in this iPad basically. So yes, this is the same iPad mini with which I started this video. If you like the video, please hit the thumbs up button and also please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. A very happy Christmas to one and all once again and thank you for watching guys. Please take care. Bye-bye.